Hello friends, today I am going to solve liquid problem number 121, base time to buy and sell stock. So we are given a list of prices and we need to find um, a day where we can buy a stock and any day after that to sell the stock such that we make the maximum profit. Um, so let, let me just show you here. Um, so by intuition, which day would you buy your stock and which day would you sell your stock basically? Or by intuition you would buy your stock here and sell your stock here right which means you are picking a day where the price is minimum to buy and a day where the price is maximum to sell right so for buying what are we doing is we are looking for minimum minimum price and for selling what are we doing is we are looking for a max maximum price right now now let's see here um there are two approaches we could solve this problem with um one is the brute force approach i'll explain you the brute force approach before explaining you the optimized one so in the brute force approach um uh, we take the, take each of the elements as the buying price and then um iterate through all of the remaining um elements in the list to find this uh, uh, selling price the maximum value so basically what are we doing is uh, for uh, first one seven so i uh, look for the uh, selling price which would be the maximum so uh, the maximum among all of these is six right so i take the maximum six but still uh, i get a negative profit here because my buying price is this and my selling price is this which gives me a negative profit here next when i uh, check for uh, next element is one so for one my selling price is the maximum selling price is six again so the profit here i make is a five for five the maximum selling price is still six so the profit that i make here is one for three for three the maximum selling price is six again so the profit i make here is um three and then for six the maximum selling price so i can only check for uh, days after my buying uh, the day i buy so i bought on this day i and the remaining prices after those days only four so four is the maximum and i am i am on a negative profit so among all of the profits that i made which is the maximum one of course five is the maximum right so this this becomes our answer i'm five is the answer and we return five but the problem here is like it is too time consuming because it's too expensive based on time as we are for each of the elements we are checking each of the other elements so for each of these one we are conducting an um, iterations times and iterations so basically we the time complexity becomes o of n squared now how can we actually reduce the time so next is we can solve this using two pointers which will give us an optimized solution so we'll use two pointer b for buying price and s for selling price and the condition is that buying price should be less than the selling price so we will look for this condition so is buying price less than selling price here no so i change my buying price to selling price and then i increment my selling price by one now is buying price less yes and what's the maximum so far so the maximum so far is five minus one which is equals to four so i'm making four so far what if i again change my selling price to some other value maybe what if i sell it on this day my um profit becomes two right and the maximum is still four so, um, what next i increment my 
uh, change my selling price to six and then my profit becomes six minus one which is equals to five so my maximum profit is five now and next again i change my selling price and now my profit becomes four minus one which is equals to three which is still less than five so my maximum profit is five here now in the case here when we have uh, this is the buying price and this is the selling price so i have modified my uh, the example here so here is still uh, buying price is less than uh, selling it's greater than selling price so i update my buying price to s and my s increments by one now my profit is here is equals to four now i again update my selling price by increasing it by uh, one index and then here what happens is my, now my buying price is not less than selling price so i update my buying price to selling price and then i increment the selling uh, index of selling price by one now my profit is equals to four uh, is equals to six so the maximum profit i make so far is six now and then i again update my selling price here and my maximum profit is still uh, six here so this is my answer now let's let's dive into the code here so um, let max equals to zero and then let left equals to zero right equals to one and then while right is left then price is at length if um price is left which is the buying price is greater than prices right um, then we update our left pointer to right and then right um, right is incremented by one but let me just increment my right here and then we also check the max profit okay I don't need this here max equals to dot prices of selling price minus price of buying and then i return my max Okay, what's wrong here if the left point price to the left is greater than to the up so the time complexity here is reduced to all and hope you have a great day